Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Every Diamond with a Bow. In today's video, we have five potential diamonds or rares. We're gonna shoot all of them with the bow, starting with this albino harlequin. Did we get it? Yes, we did, sweet. I have not done a whole lot of bow hunting on ducks before. Let's have another look. Sweet. Duck hunting with the bow is a lot of fun, can be very challenging. I have not done it at all before, but why not start with this beautiful albino harlequin? So this guy is a level two. He is a gold, sweet. So this guy is a 6.6, .6. he weighs 0 0.66 kilograms. And you don't need a vital with ducks, but we took him down with the Hawk Edge CB70. 300 grain arrows. And that is where we found him. Now, I don't know if you noticed, but there is a level three duck in the same flock. So we'll be, we will be heading back there with our bow in hand to try and get this level three Harlequin. Let's see if we can't do that again. So if you are trying to approach an animal with the bow and you have your pooch with you, I highly recommend that you get your dog to sit because I have had my dog walk right in front of me when I am lining up a shot. So that is probably good advice. And if you are sneaking up to them, the dog can spook them if the dog gets close enough to the animal. Generally the dogs don't spook too much, but the closer they get, the higher the chances that your animal is going to spook from the dog. So get it to sit and uh, then that's one load off your mind, something you don't have to worry about. So when I am lining up a shot, yeah, I need my dog to sit down. There we go. When I am lining up a shot on any duck, especially with the bow, first thing I do is spot the duck, mark it on the map very, very precisely because, you know, 10 meters difference can make a big difference. We got him. Yes, we got him. Yes. Let's look at that again. So hard to see. I wasn't even sure if I got him until I saw his body light up in the water. Here he comes. I was very lucky to find both of these ducks in the river system here in Yukon because that made it easy for me to sneak up and get real close to them and take them down with the bow. And we have a diamond harlequin duck, 7.5. He weighs 0 0.75 kilograms and we took him down from only 42.62 meters with the Hawk Edge CB70. And that is pretty sweet. And we did find him in the same flock same spot as the albino, but we actually came back the next day for him. Okay, here they are. There he is. There he is. There he is. Alrighty, so this is just a few days ago on a live stream. Found a beautiful level five wild boar on the ice here in Medved. And if you have not done any wild boar hunting on the ice in Medved, you, my friends, are missing out. There are so many of them out here. Oh my goodness. I did just do where and when to find each species in Medved. Definitely check that video out and you will be absolutely shocked. There are so many wild boar in Medved. The hunting there is amazing, so much better than Quattro. But we do have a level five here, right out in the open. I have a decent win, so hopefully we will be in good shape to take this guy down with the bow. Now I am able to lay prone and take my shot with the bow from prone because I do have the like a pro perk so I do highly recommend that. Here we go. We got him, we got him. Yay! All right, looks like we were able to take him down. It was hard to see if I even got the shot. All I could see was that need zone, but we did manage to take him down. So here's hoping he's going to make it because I have been getting trolled incessantly lately. Man, it's been bad. Yes, yes. All right, we have a diamond wild boar with the bow. All righty, so we do finally have a diamond, not a troll. Isn't that exciting? He's not a big one, just over diamond, 145.9. He weighs 217.54 kilograms and we managed a left lung liver shot with the CB60 from 54.01 meters and this is where we found him. Alrighty, so this actually happened last night on stream. We found a level five caribou. Now, 
I had a pretty good look at him and I don't think he is a diamond. I really don't. He has a stunning rack. The only problem with it is that I don't think he has double shovels. And in my experience, no reindeer and no caribou ever makes diamond without double shovels. They, they just don't. They just can't seem to make diamond without the double shovels. So that is how I tell. So this guy does not have double shovels. Otherwise he is absolutely stunning. We are gonna take him down with the bow just in case. Well, this is the only shot I have. Now the wind might push it a little, but it should be okay. So I guess we're gonna do it. Yes, we got him. So we managed to take him down with the bow, cross the water. Still don't think he's a diamond, but let's find out. All right, well, there we go. It's a troll, I knew it was, it's a big troll. They have to have double shovels. What a shame. So we do have a troll, beautiful troll, but sadly not big enough to make diamond. This guy is a 421.4. He needs to be 430 to make diamond, so he is just too small. Double shovels will bring his score up enough to cross that diamond threshold, but we did manage to take him down with the bow and this is where we found him. Still a pretty sweet little find. But here we are in Savannah. This is actually a few weeks ago. And that my friends is a very big girl. Very big Gemsbok. Now, the only female animals in the game that can score diamond are the hares, the Euro hare, and the scrub hare, and the Gemsbok. None of the other animals, none of the other females can make diamond. They will all be male. So male and female Gemsbok can make diamond. Five males, five Gemsbok males seem to troll 95% of the time, but this is actually a very big girl. So I am very hopeful that she is going to score a diamond. We are going to go after her with the crossbow. That's not... There she is. All right. Well, my wind is perfect. I don't know if I can spook them or not, but I'm not going to take any chances. That's right, big female. Big female. Oh, she is nice. She is very nice. All right. All right, here we go, crossbow time. Ready, guys? Here we go. Got her. So we did get her, let's have a look again. Well, there she is. Here we go. Diamond! She is a diamond. All right, well, that's pretty sweet. All righty, so we do have a diamond with the bow. Female Gemsbok, and she is a beauty. 340.3, she is a gray. She weighs 199.57 kilograms. And we managed a double lung liver shot with the crossbow from only 49.61 meters. And this is where we found her. All right, so let's quickly run into the lodge. So I actually have created a lodge just for this challenge. So everything in this lodge has been shot with a bow. I am trying to use all the different bows for this challenge. We haven't used them all yet, but I will be using a recurve and the long bow, so don't you worry. So this is our troll caribou. He is just a placeholder for now. We are gonna have to find a diamond, but he is very pretty. So I decided to keep him, why not? So there is our albino harlequin. They are so beautiful. Pretty excited to take it down with the bow, not gonna lie, that was a lot of fun. And there's our diamond harlequin. So I'm really excited to have one of every species in the game, a diamond from every species with the bow. And so that is the challenge. That is what we are going to be trying to do. It is going to take us quite a long time. There is our diamond boar from Medved. It was a really sweet little find. So we do have lots of space in here. And if you do own a pooch, your pooch will be in your lodge hanging out with you, which is very, very cool. That's a cape. 
pretty nice one. Boy, taking all these down with the bow, it is a lot more time consuming and a lot more challenging, but it also is a lot more fun. So I am really enjoying doing all kinds of bow hunting and let's keep it going. This is our very first one. This was a diamond musk deer and I got him on the ice. So that's gonna wrap it up for this one, guys. I really hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you'd like to join us for more, that would be amazing. All you have to do is hit that subscribe button and we will see you guys in the next one. If you guys would like to learn more amazing hotspots, check out these where and when videos. You guys take care.